Hi Wagwan, it's Lika. In today's video, I'm going to show you how I transform the skirt on the left to the dress on the right. So I'm going to start by taking the elastic band out so I can use it for a project later on. So I'm going to just pick that out. I don't have a pattern so I'm using this dress that I already own and I'm going to use that as a guide so I'm gonna cut out um, all the way up to like the shoulder as you can see I'm going straight up from there and I'll adjust that later on back and the front of the dress won't be identical I'm just working with the back layer now so what I'm doing here is just measuring how long I'm going to want the dress to be and that's from pretty much a little bit above the waist because it is going to be backless and then I added about three more inches for the droop at the back then I added even two more inches that's just for just in case since I don't have a guide here I want to have extra just in case I cut it a little bit too short I'm pinning in the front and the back piece together and I'm going to sew this part down but first I'm going to do a quick try on just to make sure I like how much of the back I left out. You can see I did fold the top of that back layer down once I got to the waist and that is for the drooping as I mentioned before. Now we can go ahead and sew the sides together. So what I'm doing now is just cutting down the neckline about an inch, inch and a half. Okay, so on both sides, I folded it about two inches, started gradually, probably half inch all the way up. Then on both sides, I folded it inwards about an inch each, kind of like a folded, like you're making pleats. All in all, I wanted it to be about 5 inches. And then I'm going to go ahead and try this on. I always do that because I'm not following a pattern. And then once I like the outcome, then I'm going to take it over to the sewing machine. Alright, so now I'm going to use my scraps to cut out the strap for the neck. And also to make the X along the waistline. So for the strap, I know I went with 32 by an inch and I cut out two of those and then I sewed them on both sides, leaving out the middle for the neck. So I left out five inch in the middle to sew that inside and I'll show you that in a second. Now I'm going to insert that neckline inside the opening of the strap and that just kind of hides all the raw edges from the neckline and it gives it a more polished finish i'm going to zoom this in a little bit so you guys can see it clearer Go ahead and add the strings to the side and this just helps with the cinching of the waist and the drape in the back. Thank you guys for watching and don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thank you.